This video is for anyone who has the task of accessing a data file in an odd format, probably a proprietary format such as Stata or SPSS. We'll cover roughly three topics, converting SPSS to Stata, Stata to SPSS, or anything to CSV. As some of the code for this video flashes along across the screen, keep in mind that this is a relatively easy task once you've mastered just a few simple lines of Python code. This video also assumes that you know how to access a Python environment and interact with Python at a very basic level. If you don't know how to do that yet, contact me and I'll get you pointed in the right direction. This kind of work helps if you do one item of setup. Install pyreadstat. Use pip to install pyreadstat and when you do that, you go to a command line at your computer and you type pip space install space pyreadstat. When you see the following on the screen, you'll know that the install was successful. The first scenario we'll look at is opening in Python a Stata file. We'll import the familiar pandas as pd, and then I'll specify in the file variable the path to my Stata file. After that, I'll put the data frame in a variable called df using pd.readstata. In order to make sure we don't leave any of the metadata behind, I'm going to use this line of code, the Stata Reader line, in order to get the data dictionary from Stata. This data dictionary will be in the form of a Python dictionary, and I can use this for loop to display that dictionary in readable output on the screen. We can also use the pandas data frame method to create a data frame of that data dictionary. Once we have a data frame, we can save that data frame to a CSV. Here is where we'll use the to CSV syntax in order to save the original data frame to a CSV for later reference. We'll use the exact same syntax on the data frame of our data dictionary in order to save that to a CSV. The very last task to demonstrate is saving to SPSS. Here we import pyreadstat that we pip installed earlier. Then we use pyreadstat in order to save SPSS format. Then we demonstrate using pandas to open that SPSS file. Thanks for watching. Hope you learned a lot. Hope you had some fun. Look forward to seeing you in the next video. Don't forget, you're more ready than you think you are. Hit subscribe, check out these other videos, and let's connect. I look forward to being in touch.